Hey y'all. So it is Tuesday and I have a dad's appointment. So I just got to the appointment. And it's early, y'all. I left work early today. That made me excited because I never leave work early. I don't miss days at work or anything. It just feels so good to just be out before five o'clock. I can't explain it. It just feels so good. <sighs> How y'all doing? You ever seen somebody excited about being at a doctor's appointment? I have to weigh and it's late in the afternoon and I like to only weigh in the morning, you know, and I got all these clothes on. So mentally, my mind is not gonna be able to handle a few extra pounds because I know what I weighed the last time I weighed. So let's just pray that my mind don't think this is my weight. I normally weigh early in the morning. This is the afternoon. If you gain a few pounds, you know, you know very well that you gain a few pounds in the afternoon. Everybody does, okay? That's why you weigh the same time every day. So we're gonna see what the scale gonna say. And I'll let you know. I most certainly am not letting y'all know. I'm not letting y'all know. Y'all know that I'm in the hundreds. When I get to 188, that's when I'll let y'all know. Maybe the middle of March. Cause I'm hoping to be like 165 by June 1st. So we'll see. Doo -doo -doo. Not edit my video for this week and it's Valentine's Day. And I'm about to go to the gym. I just got off work, I have to cook dinner, go to the gym, take a shower, and then go back to work tomorrow. So, really tired. I'm gonna push myself to go. I do not think I'm gonna get this video out until probably, I don't know when, y'all. I'm tired every day and I work out every day. So, your guess is as good as mine. I guess it's gonna be one of those weeks that I don't get one out until Sunday. Sorry. Good morning, you guys. It is Thursday morning. And uh, pack me something small. I did not have much to pack because we can't take, we can't like heat up fish in the microwave. And y'all know I have salmon a lot. But I packed me some strawberries and blueberries. No, strawberries and blackberries. These strawberries were so sweet and delicious last night. Um, I had a tiny bit of tuna that was left and some cheese. So I'm eating some dairy today. And I'm not going to eat all these, but I'm going to eat a little bit. So that's what I'm taking for, I guess you can say lunch. I gotta put some more water in my water bottle because I'm not late, but I'm pushing, you know, like the time that I like to leave. But I just wanted to say good morning to y'all before I left. That's what I'm wearing to work today. I love this shirt, it's getting too big. I have it on with some boots. I mean, it's okay, but it's just like a lot of room. Very bad words. I need some water. And my water's ready. Did I drink for that water? I drink like half of it. It's a full gallon. I try to do like a half gallon. I don't think I drank enough yesterday because I got a charge more. And I didn't work my legs yesterday, so. The Charlie horse had to literally come from just not getting enough water. But I have to go. I love y'all. I'll talk to y'all later. All right, y'all. So I made it to work. And it is 8. Not 8. It's 7.52. I like to get inside like 7.55, 5 minutes before 8 o'clock. And that's what I'm about to go do. So I just wanted to say I hope y'all enjoyed this little ride with me. Getting ready for work, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. This is probably going to be in the vlog. Hopefully, y'all like it or y'all watch it. I don't know. My views are in the toilet right now. They used to be like 1,000, 1,500, 900. Baby, my last video barely, I don't even think it's at 400. So, if y'all know, like, that discourages me. Because I don't know why. Well, I know why. Because you want your people to be notified and watch stuff and i don't know it's just different now but i'm not gonna stop that's what i'm not gonna do i want to invite y'all into more of my fitness stuff and you know but i want to meet make some goals before i do that i want to change some stuff up around in my home is that my coworker? let me go i love that what's up y'all happy friday it is friday morning I am about to head to work. Y'all know Fridays are my favorite day of the week. 
I got my light blue bangles on. I got this shirt that's actually a little dress. Remember in the video I did, I couldn't fit it. It was way too small. I couldn't even close it. And now I literally have it on with a pair of jeans. It's super duper cute. I will show y'all, but my bathroom mirror is dirty as always. Hold on. This is the shirt right here. I have it on with some jeans. It's really a dress and some Converse. But it's Friday, and on Fridays, you know, we wear um, we wear jeans and sneakers. So I'm happy it's Friday. I'm happy that it's the end of the week. It's my favorite day of the week, and I'm about to go to work. So y'all have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to y'all later. All right, y'all. So it is 10 o'clock. My break is almost over. My break is over at 10.15, but it's, a little, it's almost 10.15. I just want to say hey to y'all real quick. I just took some pictures, sent my niece some daily pics of me. We do this a lot. Me and Jaquayla always take pictures and send each other. Try to motivate each other. I was just getting way too loud in here and excited with my coworker. <laughs> but I gotta go. I'll talk back with y'all. Happy Friday. So, my cousin Fiona just left my job. Yes, I'm talking about you, Fee. I told her that I want something good to eat today. I've been doing good. I'm actually at a little um, plateau. I think I told y'all that earlier. My plateau is like, I, I haven't been able to like drop in a couple of weeks, really like a few weeks. And I would say longer because it hasn't been like a big number. It's been very, very small. Lose a pound, gain a pound, lose a pound, gain a pound, lose a pound, you know, whatever. I'm still pretty low. But I'm annoyed with it. So I was going to treat myself today. And she's like, don't do it. So I just had my regular old when I don't pack. Now, this is the thing. The reason why I didn't pack lunch is because, y'all, they don't allow any fish heated up in our microwaves at work. And I eat a lot of fish and a lot of salmon. So I can't bring it. I can't bring it to work the next day. So, a lot of times when I have that, I have to go, like, to Subway or get something else. Now, yesterday, I had tuna, but tuna's all gone. So, I went to Subway, but I wanted something. I wanted Chick-fil-A. To be honest with y'all, I really wanted Chick-fil-A. My cousin's like, Tad, you're doing so good. Don't do it. <sighs> What's going on here? Like, what? what is really going on no, that I look at me like that? Like, why are you just, like, on me like this? This is weird. Somebody miss me. I'm a baby, Tad. He's not a baby. He's a big, he big rock while ahead. Exactly. I'm the last person. Anybody else in here with me? I'm the strongest tonight. I'm the last person leaving. What time is it? I don't know. But everybody's probably about to go out. I'm about to eat some salmon and some collards and take a shower and watch a movie. Bye, y'all. Good morning. Mm. That sounds so nasty, but it's Saturday morning, y'all. Mm. Y'all know where I'm about to go. In there with him. That man just walked in there. Mm-mm. He don't got an app on his phone. You ain't going there with me, son. I'm going to sit right here and eat my plum. I'm going to play that mess. Do I look tired? You just had a plum. Give us some energy. My water. Do you know how good water is for you? Like, it's good for your body. It's good for your health. It's good for your, your skin. Water is, like, really, really good for you. Drink your water. It's better than any juice. It's better than any sodas. It is so good for you. Stop trying to water shame me. Yes, I'm drinking my water. Yes, I'm ordering water with my food. Yes, I only drink water. Yes, I'm a water drinker. I shared this video with my cousins. 
this um, video, this guy, he was acting like he was like all that because he only thing he drink is water. Yes, we know we all that. Uh oh, uh oh, they go Nigel and his wife. Oh, his daughter. They about to go crush the gym like me. He got his tripod. He got his baby girl. I'm about to go in there with you, bro. Let me get in there. Hello, y'all. So it is Saturday. And I literally said that I wasn't doing absolutely nothing today but coming home and getting clean and putting these PJs on, honey, and laying down all day. I told somebody that yesterday, and that's exactly what I did. But I did work out. So I managed to have a really, 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 really good workout um, on chest and triceps. I tried to record something, but I didn't really like it. So now I get in that video. But I'll show y'all um, a video that I recorded last night in the gym. I actually posted it on Instagram. I'll show it after this. Um, but I'm going to try to show y'all some of my workouts. My workouts take, they can be an hour to an hour 15 to an hour 30. It just depends. But today was triceps. I'm so proud of my arms. Today was triceps and chest and abs. This guy... He was a trainer. He was like, working out is something. It doesn't get easy at first. Like, the more you work out, we need to go to dinner soon. My cousin told me we need to go to dinner soon. Let me call her. Hold on, y'all. I love muscles. Okay, y'all, so real quick. So, I'm, I'm, it's going to be a second. So, I was just talking to y'all about how I wasn't doing anything right. Like, not getting off this couch. And my cousin just texted me. She's like... We need to get together and go out to eat. I literally just saw her um, yesterday. She came to my job. And um, <laughs> she wants to go out to eat. So I'm going. I can't wait to see my cousin. I love her dearly. I'll probably get a salmon um, wherever I'm, where we're going. I think she she, she picked Carabas. Um, I know I definitely don't need no pasta. Um, so I'll probably get like a salmon and some asparagus. I got that a while back. From there and it was pretty good so i'll probably get something simple like that just because it's you know stay focused but um yeah she was like let's go out to dinner so so i'm about to get off my spot but no time soon right now it's 3 15 we're not meeting until about 7 and i'll probably start getting ready close to 6 like 5 50 i'll probably like you know start getting cute putting on some makeup you know y'all know how i do and i'll probably show y'all I don't, I can't really fit any clothes. All my cute outfits are becoming like my work outfits because everything is like big or like little baggy. So much room in all my clothes now. Um, I could go get something to wear, but I'm too tired. You know, I'm just, just going to dinner with my cousin. So whatever I find will be good enough. Okay. It's going to just have to be. It's just going to have to be because it is what it is. But I'm happy I get some footage for y'all. And hopefully I get my video uploaded tonight so I can post tomorrow. Because I edited the video. I just need to upload it and post it tomorrow. Because it's been probably like 12 days since I posted my last video. And then hopefully this video I'll post like Wednesday or something. I'm not going to make no promises. But being that I don't have a video to edit tomorrow. I'm going to try to edit this video tomorrow. And upload it tomorrow so I can get two videos out this week. Since I was being, you know, lazy last week. Not being lazy at all. Just very, very, very busy. But, um, I'm watching this girl's YouTube channel. Um, her name. I don't even know what her name is. Because it's not saying it. Yes. Ignore my Christmas decorations. I'm full aware that it's almost the end of February. And I still have this stuff up. I'm aware of it, Okay. Y'all, I don't know what to tell you. The only thing I can tell you is working from 8 until 5, going to the gym, cooking, taking a shower, and coming home five days a week, has, it has wiped me out. It has wiped me out. And I have been, I started this, the working out, I've started in September, but the weight training it is even harder. Like the weight training is harder than just like me just taking a walk. Weight training really wipes me out. And like you be like really sore. Like today my hamstrings hurt so bad. Like sitting on the toilet hurts. 
like just you're going to the bathroom. Like it hurts. Very sore. I did my biceps last night. Right now, my biceps are in pain. Like doing this, ouch, ouch, ouch. That hurts. I did my triceps and chest today. So tomorrow, I can look forward to all of this hurting really bad. And the bottoms of my arm hurt really bad. So my legs probably won't hurt anymore tomorrow. My biceps probably hurt just a tiny bit. It's like either one or two days. It's just you're just in pain, whatever muscle you work. So I'm just like doing it or either I'm just going to just tell my children, like, can y'all do it for me? But the reason why I like to do it because I like to take really good care of my things. And I know that I'm the only person that's going to really take good care. I don't want nobody like toss my stuff in there, throw my stuff, break my stuff. I like wrap a lot of things because there are a lot of things over there that I wrap and some I don't but long story short the tree is still up and I don't care what y'all gotta say about it it is what it is not not all y'all but some of the negative Nancy's like come take it down then come take it down but I wasn't gonna put no makeup on I gave myself a facial earlier today and I was gonna do no makeup but I am and next time y'all see me, I will have some more. All right, y'all. So this is my little snack that I just made. And I know, I know it doesn't look, you know, as healthy as the, like, Fit Gurus because I have raisins and strawberries and granola. That's a bit much and a little bit of honey. I know, I know, y'all. But I'm just upping it a little bit this weekend because Monday, I, I think I'm going to start this cleanse on this 10-day cleanse. I know I said it before and I failed. I'm going to try again. So I'm upping my calories a little bit this weekend. Because I'm trying to get out of this like plateau. So they said up your calories. They said for three days. I'm only doing it for two days. They said up your calories for like three days. And then go really strict. So I'm going to. I'm trying to do that on Monday. But I'm not doing it too too bad. But I'm going to. You know, we'll see what I do. But this is the little snack that I made for me. It looks really, really good. But it has some really healthy stuff in it. It has some... I forgot what that oil is. It's some type of oil. I'll put it here if I remember it. I don't feel like getting up to get it again. Some flax seeds. Some some other type of little oil. Um, and some Greek yogurt. Okay, so this is my little snack. And I'm going to dinner with my cousin. But this is what I'm eating. All right, you guys, so it is time for me to go to dinner with my cousin. I'm in Salon's messy room. Shh, don't tell her because I'm going to show y'all what I have on um, in her mirror. I don't feel like going back in there because I'm about to head out the door. Y'all have seen this outfit. Ain't nothing new. So this is what I'm wearing. I don't have much to wear. And that's because all of my stuff is kind of like too big. It's either too big or just look like work clothes, which this is a work shirt too. And it's kind of big too now, but this is what I have on. This is what Mama T is wearing. I'm just going to dinner with my cousin and this is what I'm wearing. Okay. Hope y'all like it. But if you don't, I'm good with that too, because guess what? I like it and that's all that matters to me. Because baby, my clothes, it matters to me what I like, but I'll be back. Are you recording me? Yeah, I almost said something. Wow. Good morning, you guys. It is Monday morning, and this is a, I don't know if this is a new vlog, same vlog. I don't know what it is, but hey, good morning. Welcome to my channel. Make sure y'all like and subscribe, you know, so you can be, make sure your notifications are on. So you can be notified, you know what I'm saying? Like, do what you need to do so you can see when I post. But it's Monday morning, it's early. I'm about to go to work. Um, I am trying to do the green smoothie cleanse. I hope I succeed. 10 days of me just drinking, minus eating a little bit of eggs and tuna here or there, and nuts, walnuts and stuff like that is what I'm going to try to do. I don't know if I'm gonna make it through. Last time I tried it a few weeks ago, I think I did it one day, and then the next day I tried to do it. I did it for breakfast and lunch, and I had a sensible dinner, and then it just I went back to eating healthy. I tried, but it just I, I didn't make it. So I'm trying again today. I'm on my way to work. Um, I want to do the cleanse because I'm so close to my goal 
Well, I'm so cool where I was when I had got to 187 that I really want to do the cleanse in hopes that it gets me there. It gets me really close to being there. Just knack a little boost, you know, but I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I'm going to try. So just bear with me, okay? Just bear with me. I love y'all. There it is. My breakfast and lunch. And I got some walnuts. That's what I'm about to be eating today. I hope, look, I remember when I tried and failed before someone said to me, you know, try to do what you say you're gonna do. And it, look, I tried, I wanted to finish. It just, I was very cranky at work. My job is not the type of place that like, you know, you have a lot to do, so. I really need the strength of the Lord to help me finish it because, like, you be, like, hungry at work and cranky, and then you have to, like, deal with a lot of people, a lot of co-workers, like, a lot of customers, a lot of co-workers, and a lot of different little jobs that you have to do. So, like, and I'm an emotional eater, so, you know, I be wanting my little stuff, but I got me some walnuts in there, which I do not like walnuts at all. So, I'm just going to be sipping on this drink pretty much from morning until I leave. Then come home and make another one. And then have me some boiled eggs and tuna for like my dinner snack with another smoothie. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Hopefully it holds me. I did it before. My niece is like, you did it twice. You can do it again. I'm like, I can do it 10 days. And the reason why I wanna do it, y'all, I'm, I'm, I should show y'all, but like my stomach, my lower stomach sits right at where my hips are. And you really can't see my hips. I have small hips, but I have hips. But the reason you can't see my hips is because of my stomach. And you can't tell because you're not going to be able to know. Y'all going to be like, you know, I don't see what she's talking about. But like, I know. I know how my body is and like right where it sits. So I tried to show y'all and I'm cutting it out because it just it wasn't working right. And I don't feel comfortable. But my stomach, this is my stomach right here. And your hips are right here. But my stomach is here too, and it's here too, and it sits right here. You know what I'm saying? So, you probably don't know what I'm talking about, but I know. And women who have stomachs now. And we're trying to get rid of them. And I know that no dairy, and you know, they say it's what you eat, what gets rid of stomachs, like the bloat and stuff. So, I'm just trying to see for these next 10 days if I can get shrink the stomach down some more. And continue to do what I've been doing, but I just need like a little boost just for me, just like a little, little, little tiny boost. So that's what I'm doing. But um, other than that, I'm going to, you know, get back to what I've been doing. And you know, I'm lifting weights and I'm really going hard in the gym, but it, the gym probably won't be as hard as it's been because I probably won't have the energy to do what I've been doing, but I'm still gonna do like the elliptical and I might do like two sets of weights for these next 10 days, like two things. But I've been going hard on like four and five different machines and four and five different exercises. But for these next 10 days, I'm going to slow up and do maybe the elliptical and maybe two, two things, like maybe two exercises for my, you know, my weight training, um, if I have the energy. So we're going to see. We're going to see. I'm a little nervous. I don't want to lose any muscle that I gain. It takes a long time to build muscle, and like longer than what you think, like for real. But... I'm gonna keep talking y'all. It's almost 7.30 and I gotta go. I love y'all. Hey y'all. So last night I made Ethan some lobster tails. I'm gonna show y'all a picture of them right there. Those are lobster tails I made for him. I should have recorded when I was doing it, but I was so like, I didn't know if they were gonna turn out right. He loved them here like, oh my goodness, mama. They were so delicious, like the best ever. I just went to YouTube and I, um, I followed this recipe. They were like, make the butter. And in the butter, you add the lemon. I had all this by the grace of God. Lemon, butter, um, parsley, and paprika. And then on the lobster tails, you put salt, pepper, garlic. On the, like, sprinkle that on a lobster and then, like, rub the butter on them and put them in the oven on 400. 
and I did it for, um, it said 15 minutes. I was a little bit nervous, so I did like 16 minutes. I just really wanted it to be good, but not overcook. Because my cousin told me that if you overcook it, it tastes like rubber. So I didn't really want to overcook it, but I wanted it to be cooked all the way. And Ethan said they were so delicious. I didn't taste them. I wish I would have. He got them from, um, where did he get them from? Publix. And he said they were on sale. They were like seven bucks a piece. So I'll probably go get me some. But not in the next 10 days. <laughs> but, um. I'm on my break. It's time for me to go back. I love y'all. Let's see what I'm looking like today. Oh, y'all already saw me. Never mind. Good morning, you guys. Happy Tuesday. It is Tuesday morning. Y'all, I just did... I've been doing this plan. It's called Deep Cleanse. If you have the Bible app on your phone, look at the um, plan called Deep Cleanse. It's really, really good. I've been doing it. It really blessed me, and today's day really blessed me. I'm a little behind with it, and I went forward, and I'm coming back, so I think it was day three. It talked about, you know, um, gave the Bible verses about Adam and Eve when, about shame. It was talking about shame and how after you sin, you're supposed to go to God, and most people, or well, a lot of people, hide from God pretty much how Adam and Eve did after they they tried to hide from him but it just was really really good and it's about time for me to go inside I don't want to but I have to um but I will talk to y'all later all right y'all so this is what Michaela is torturing me with today look at Michaela her beautiful look, self y'all I'm so mad at her it smells so good and look what I'm <laughs> I'm so sad. And you should because it smells amazing. And I'm sitting here looking stupid, drinking this old nasty smoothie. I'm playing y'all, but I'm not. Hey y'all. So I just got off work and I literally felt like I was about to faint. Not like for real faint pass out, but just like I'm so hungry. So I drank most of my smoothie. And I just I don't want no more. And oh, her sweater's pretty. And I need to um, cook or something, but I don't have time to cook because I have to go to the gym. And my mother was off work, and she's at my home, and she's not cooking till later, and I need something to eat before I go to the gym. And I'm not eating carbs, so I can't just, like, put something in my mouth real quick. And I don't need no more fruit because I already had enough strawberries and blueberries in my smoothies. So I stopped at Texas Row House, and I got me some pork chops <laughs> they're grilled lord please they better be grilled i hope they don't have fried ones but i got some grilled pork chops and some broccoli and a salad with no croutons now i love croutons on my salad but i'm not eating no croutons because i'm not eating any carbs for 10 days and i also told her please don't you know please make sure they don't give me any bread because i can't have bread either so I'm struggling, and I'm going to taste some of my food before I go to that gym. Is this my food? It's mine. It's not mine. I'm so hungry, y'all. I'm literally going to take some bites in this car before I leave, because right when I go home, I got to put this food up, and I have to get dressed and go head out to the gym. And today is back and biceps, and I believe I'm going to take y'all with me so we can improve, and I'm going to show y'all a little bit of my workout, okay, if y'all want to see it. Mm. I'll show y'all my food. Y'all, oh my goodness, so amazing, amazing, mmm, and here's my salad without croutons, I'm sad about that, but I'm gonna eat it anyway. Good morning, beautiful people, happy Wednesday, we're moving right along, y'all, we are moving right along throughout the week, it's gonna be Friday soon, okay, I just wanna say happy Wednesday, y'all, good morning, so I'm gonna show this shirt I got on. I decided to come into the lounge room because her mirror is clean, okay? So, yesterday I was at work and my coworker just sat this shirt down. And I was like, somebody put a shirt on my desk or on my chair? And they were like, yeah. They were looking a little sneaky. Like, they didn't want to say who did it. But she gave me this shirt and I think it is so pretty. She bought it. It was too big for her. Uh-oh, I see you. She bought it and it was too big for her because she's really, really tiny. So she gave it to another girl and then the other girl was like, she couldn't fit it. But y'all know Mama T is stacked up there. So I knew it my, you know what, will swallow the shirt. And it did. I think it's really cute. I like it. 
Um, let's talk about the scale. So I'm not supposed to wait until um I'm not supposed to wait until the end of the month. That's what me and my niece said. And one of my cousins said, look, you need to do what you said you're going to do. Try, try to make a practice of doing what you said you're going to do. And I really do because I don't even want to lie to myself or say I'm going to do something and not do it. Like, yo, I got on the scale anyway. And I was not supposed to wait until the end of the month. I lost one more pound. Y'all, it's inching. I mean, when I say inching. It's like been two pounds, but I can't front. I went out to eat. Y'all saw that. Oh, no, y'all didn't see it. Oh, yes, y'all did in this video right here. I went out to eat over the weekend. I had way too much bread. And I had um, some lasagna and some stuffed mushrooms. Excuse my home, y'all. I need to clean up. But I had all that. I'm saying that because that's probably why it's moving slow. I don't know, but I don't want to like just never have things because that makes it really difficult to lose weight. So, and I don't want to not enjoy, you know, time with my family, just always being strict. So once a month, I was talking to this guy yesterday at work, once a month, he has type one diabetes and he said once a month, he has like ice cream, something he enjoys and his blood sugar is good. Just once a month, he might have something that he wants. Like he literally has insulin on his body like I couldn't believe it like I'm talking to this man he's older man he's had it for a long time and he looks so good and he works out really hard and I mean he showed me his insulin so we just were talking he came in the break room he brings donuts for us every day but um I don't think he eats them like that but he not every day uh he brings donuts like whenever he comes to the job and he was so sweet and so kind and so nice, but I don't eat any of his donuts. He said, hey, Terry. And I'm like, I'm just sitting here ignoring your donuts. That's how the conversation got started. Because I always send my cousins and my family members different pictures of his donuts that he brings, either Krispy Kreme or Dunkin' Donuts. And I'm glad that he stopped bringing Krispy Kremes because those made me really sad. Ignoring Dunkin' don't make me that sad because I never really was a Dunkin' person. But Krispy Kreme donuts, ignoring those is really, really hard. But I still do it. But um, I know I can't have donuts every every week or, you know, because it's healed by like three boxes. So it won't be like just having one. It'll be like every day probably having like two until they're gone. And that will not help me reach my goal. So I just stay clear from them, period. We had a little conversation. We was talking about it. And then I ended up showing him some of my before pictures. Y'all, I'm going to do a weight loss video again. I'm at from my heaviest 60 pounds lost. And I think I did how I lost 60 pounds before. So I want to either do a How I Lost 70 Pound video, but that's like, I got to lose like 10 more pounds and I'm struggling, struggling to lose 10 pounds. I just lost two and I'm doing everything that I possibly can do. My body just got to gotta do what it's got to do. You know, I have the days like they were saying, like when you have a plateau, eat higher calorie foods for a few days. I was too scared to do it for three days, but I did it for two days and I didn't work out for one day. But I'm supposed to eat high calorie food and not work out for three days. I don't want to do it, but I might do it if it continues being hard. But um, we will see. But I hope y'all have a wonderful day. I hope I have a wonderful day today. Remember to keep the Lord with you. Trust the Lord to help you with all of your battles, including weight battles, family battles, heart that are broken battles. Because some people are suffering from their heartaches and, um, you know. Do your best to put your trust in the Lord and try to spend time not just talking about God, but spending time with God, talking to him, praying to him, praising him. Spend time doing that, y'all. It's really the best way to be. And I'm not perfect, y'all. I fall short, but just trust the Lord, you know, to catch you when you fall, okay? Have a wonderful Wednesday. Make it a wild Wednesday. Put on some animal print. Bam, because I'm going to wear it every day just about. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Happy Thursday, you guys. Good morning. It is Thursday. And we are literally this close to the weekend. I hope y'all are doing okay. Um, I did not. I tried to show y'all some of my workout last night. Don't look at my Christmas tree. I know. I know it's February the 21st or 22nd and that thing is still up. But we, we just don't pay no attention here. So don't y'all, okay? I got two on my face right here. Look. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'm ignoring them too. Anyways, I've been so busy working out. I don't have, I'm not thinking about those trees. If you want to be real, I'm not thinking about them. So, whatever. Say what you want to say in the comments. I don't care. But anyways, 
it is, I worked out yesterday. Yesterday was my day off, but I still worked out because I'm going to make my day off Friday. I know I've been saying I've been enjoying Fridays, but I think Friday I want to like just eat me something that I'll enjoy and like maybe visit one of my friends. You know what I'm saying? Like instead of just going to the gym on Friday nights. So I said my workout Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, skip Friday, have a great workout Saturday, and then Sunday have a break. Because also, y'all, Saturday morning workouts, I'd be like really tired before I even get started because I've been killing it that Friday night. So I'm going to do it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, break Friday, go hard Saturday, my last workout of the week. So those are my like four workouts of the week. No, five workouts of the week because I go Monday through Thursday and then Saturday, five a week. So Sunday, I may take a walk or I may not do anything, but I may just take like a, you know, a stroll in the neighborhood because yesterday this person told me that the doctor says your heart loves to walk. So be trying to take care of this heart. So, and switching up, I've been doing the treadmill and the bike instead of the elliptical because the treadmill and bike helped me lose more weight. So um, I got on the scale. I have not had carbs in three days. Today will be day four. I've lost two pounds. I'm so grateful, y'all, because it's been really hard getting this weight down. So, But I have to go. I got to make these smoothies that I, I don't want to drink. I'm just going to be honest. I don't want to drink it. Um, Let's see if my bathroom mirror clean. Hold on. No, not really. But we're, it's not really clean, but we're going to we're gonna. I'm gonna show y'all something. Look, y'all see all this room in this shirt? Do y'all see this shirt? This is how my clothes be looking at work. Way too big. Look. You see that? But it's okay. This is what we're we dealing with. My bras are too big. I need some new bras. I just need some stuff, y'all. But we ain't buying it yet. We're we going to get some stuff, but just not yet. But I try to put on some red lipstick. I got makeup on my shirt and I got oil on my shirt. But guess who not changing? Me. Please don't fall. Yeah. Oh, I have to. Okay, ignore that shirt and towel. I could just did this. But yeah, this is what I was trying to show y'all. You see all this room? This is this shirt used to be tight. Y'all know I used to be like really tight in this shirt. This shirt used to be like really tight on me. My coworkers are gonna be like, girl, none. But. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get some. But my bras are very expensive. They could be like $50, $60, $70 unless they're on sale. So we buy them like two at a time, okay? And I definitely need some. <laughs> but I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll be back. What's up, y'all? I'm back. So y'all, I decided to put my cheeseburger earrings on because I haven't had carbs three days. Today is day four. My huge water bottle decides to fall every time I move. But I decided to wear my cheeseburger earrings because I want me a cheeseburger. I don't care if it's a turkey burger or what, but I want me a bun and some meat. However, we are on day four with no carbs and we are struggling. We made our smoothie, we have our water, we have our nuts at work. Thanks to Candace. Candace bought me some pistachios and I've been eating them. And I have to be honest, Ethan, <laughs> chased me in the house chased after me because i told y'all ethan had all this valentine's day candy and he i had one piece of it one piece i said you let me have that and he was like no he said no because you told me if you ask say no don't let you have it he chased me around the house because i grabbed that joker i grabbed that little one piece of chocolate candy y'all it was like 27 calories for one okay so i <laughs> i wish i had it on film y'all if y'all could see us y'all would be like Lay always be like, y'all need a whole reality show. My family, they're nuts, okay? I mean, they're they're nuts. But it was so good. It was so good. Oh, my goodness. It, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. But that was a little cheap because I'm not supposed to have any carbs at all. And that is a carb because it's like chocolate. But it was 27 calories. And I woke up this morning still one pound lighter. I'm grateful for that. And I'm on my way to work. I left a little bit later. Whenever my mother is off work, it like makes me. Yeah, so whenever my mama is off work, I talk to her and we talk. This morning we were talking about carbs because my mother 
is telling me, my mama, she'll say like, because I'll say something like, you know, I'm not eating carbs for 10 days. And she'll say something about it like, not eating carbs 10 days. She didn't know that I had lost another pound. So she just thought like, I won't eat carbs and I didn't lose weight. But if I don't eat carbs, I'm going to lose some weight. It's going to be more than it is when I eat carbs. However, you can eat carbs and lose weight. I'm not saying you can't. But sometimes when you have been doing like a certain program, like I've been doing what I've been doing. I started this whole eating healthy again in like September. In September I started when I tried to like start with the ladies on my Instagram page. I'm going to show that right here. So I tried with the ladies. I kind of like failed. Well, we didn't fail, but we I stopped posting on there. And I keep saying I'm going to try to post on there again, but I just haven't. And it's like whenever I go on my breaks, I have so much to do. Either call somebody or just want to chill and relax. So I don't really, I haven't been posting like that. So, like I said, I started in September. By December, I went to D.C. and Saron has showed some, shared some stuff with me. Um, with eating so I started his stuff too I incorporated what he showed me with what I already was doing but I had already lost some weight from September to December so I've lost even more hold on I don't know where I was off. I don't know where I was at because I got a phone call but what I was trying to say is my mama wants to continue to eat all these carbs and I was trying to tell her mama you cannot eat those carbs and think that the weight is going to move like you want to. You can't have some carbs, but you're going to have to cut some carbs. So instead of having like four carbs in a day, maybe try one. You know, that's what I did cuz that's what I was doing. Like that's what I was saying. Um from December to now I've really been eating like two meals a day. Um because I eat y'all and I'm it's I just I I don't eat all them meals no more. Number one, you don't have to eat all those meals to be healthy and to live. We just a greedy, greedy country that we act like we got to eat a whole bunch. And my meals are big enough, and then I might have a snack if I desire, but most days I don't. So I I eat between like 1 o'clock. Well, it's different right now since I'm dr drinking these smoothies. Since I'm drinking these smoothies, I start drinking them when I get to work because um, I, I don't want to get hungry. So these 10 days are different, but normally I eat, I start eating at one. That's my first meal at one. And then I eat dinner like after my workout and I don't have time to eat nothing else, nor do I want anything else. Um, I might have a snack here or there, piece of fruit, some type of nuts or something like that. But y'all, it's time for me to go in this job. Let me go. I'll talk back with y'all in a little bit. Hey y'all. So it is six o'clock and I just got off work, went home. Freshen myself up a little bit and put my gym clothes on. And y'all, I do not feel like going inside the gym. My shoulders, I must have worked. So yesterday was chest and triceps. Y'all, when I tell y'all I worked, oh, I'm I'm so sore. Like, and it didn't happen until like, no, it was happening when I was at work. I wasn't feeling that great. My shoulders are hurting. So, I'm going to do um, legs, of course, like glutes, booty and glutes. Booty and legs day, it's, 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 it's leg day. So, with leg day, you know, you do your glutes, hams. And I'm tired. I don't know if I have the energy for this, but I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. What the heck was that? I just saw something run. What is that? Oh, those are birds. You ever see something like go by real quick? Okay, some birds. But I'm about to go in here. I pray, 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 Lord. Give me the strength for this. Help me, Lord. So my cousin asked me to go out to eat with her tonight. And, you know, she knows I'm eating healthy. We can get something healthy. So we're going to go to Logan's. I was just going to get the mesquite chicken salad with no croutons and no bread. I won't go eat no bread. But now she said, never mind. And I have a taste for a salad. I want a salad so bad. So, I even want a nasty Wendy salad. Or like Chipotle. Like, I don't, I'm not saying Wendy salads are nasty. But you know, like, stuff, stuff be nasty good sometimes. Like, y'all ever get that chili salad, that taco salad from Wendy's? They put the chili in it. Then they, sour cream. That is so good. Nasty. <laughs> but you eat it with nachos. I can't have the carbs. I'm not supposed to have dairy. But 
I'm doing it my way, so I'm eating dairy if I choose to. So, all I had was, I had some, today I had my smoothies all day. Sorry, I had my smoothies all day. And then when I came home, I had a serving size of salmon so I can have the energy to work out. So, I do feel better. Like, I have the energy to work out. And then I'm getting me a salad tonight from somewhere. I don't even know where. But that's that. And I'll be back. All right, y'all, so I'm about to do some hip thrust. I'm definitely not showing that. It's not really cute. It doesn't feel cute, it feels really weird, but you have to do it. And I'm about to do it in here. I'm sorry I can't show y'all my workout. My niece was here and I did those three machines and I'm probably gonna walk for like 25 minutes. I'm giving it my all on a very tired day with low, low energy. But um, I'm gonna show y'all what I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it with this. This is 40 pounds, 40 pounds, so it's heavy, but I'm about to get started. Happy Friday, y'all. It's Friday. It is fabulous, beautiful, amazing, wonderful Friday. Yes, it's raining, but it's still beautiful. Happy Friday because it's Friday. Y'all, I'm getting my hair done like this again next week. Amber going to do my hair. I'm probably going to... um. I'm probably going to get it different. They know probably about it. I'm going to get it different for my birthday because I want, I'm going to like pop out with something totally different. I might even do a wig with baby hairs. That would be so strange because y'all know I don't do that. But I don't know. I'm going to do something different for my birthday. Um, probably like a sew-in or something. I'll probably leave like my hair out. I don't know. But I'm going to do this again because um, I'm probably not getting no braids. This is This hair right here is like 34 bucks. Then I pay my girl her money and baby, I'll be set. And she like redoes it for me every like, you know, does my edges for me when needed. So that's all I'm going to do. But I'm about to go in this building. Let me pray. I prayed earlier, but I need to really pray to the Lord for strength for today to help me get through it. So I will see y'all a little bit later when I get inside. But I just have on, y'all want to see what I got on? I have on some black jeans, some white Chuck Taylors, and this little shirt right here. Why does it look like that? And yes, I did say look. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Happy Saturday. Y'all already know where I'm at. I didn't come last night. I just kind of like, just chilled at my house. It was so nice, y'all. I love Friday nights. Friday nights are like my favorite night. So if I work out or if I don't work out, I love Friday nights. Cause like the last day of the work week and I just get to chill. Do what I want to do. This is what I'm dealing with. Those two little 15 pound weights, which are not light for me. I know some people do like 30, 40, but baby, these 15 pounds, on this thing right here, me lay back like this, talking about this right here, oh yes. Oh, it feels so good. It feels so easy doing it now. Y'all, look at these arms. Y'all already know the struggle I've been dealing with these arms. And they are going down tremendously. Oh, my goodness. I'm so excited about these arms. And the rest of me. You said, whose who stomach? Not mine. <laughs> Trust me, I still have a stomach. But I just want to say, hey, y'all, I'm so tired. And I'm eating some carbs today. I cannot wait. I was gonna do it 10 straight days, but I'm gonna enjoy my weekend. I'm gonna have me a carb today. I think I'm gonna go to um, Publix and see if they got some lobster tails. If they still have some on sale, I'm gonna grab four, two for me, two for Ethan. And then I don't know if I make sweet potatoes or those small little white potatoes and some vegetables, but that's gonna be my little treat for today. I'm gonna get on a scale when I leave here. We're gonna see what I weigh. If I am happy, I'll share, okay? So we'll see. Cause I'm trying to weigh before that time of the month. Cause you know, last month I only gained two pounds. I think I told y'all that, but I'm hoping I'll gain nothing this month. 
but I want to get on that scale beforehand so I could just see, you know, where I'm at. I'm proud of these things right here. I'm proud of them. They are coming along. All right, so right here I'm in Publix and I wanted some lobster tails, so I came to grab some up. And they had some delicious looking seafood. Honey, they had salmon, they had shrimp, they had crab legs. They had a bunch of stuff. I think that was some type of stuffed something. I don't know, maybe I'll try it one day. But I ended up getting the four lobster tails. And I think the lobster tails that I showed y'all earlier in the video, hopefully I took it out, was from this picture instead of when I cooked them from Ethan the first time. So, you know, if you're still watching, Say, Mama T, I'm still watching in the comment section because it's 51 minutes in, baby. This is a long video, but I hope y'all are enjoying. Let me know down below. All right, guys. So, today is a big deal. I got on the scale, y'all, and that thing said 195. And I don't think y'all realize how that means I've, I'm in, t in this whole week, I think I've lost three pounds. And I'm super duper excited about it. That thing said 195. 195. Like that is a big deal. A big deal. 195. Coming from 258. Coming from 241. Coming from 238. Coming from 225. Coming from 220, 218, 210, 203, 202. That stay with me for like a month. 200. To 199, to 198, to 197, to 195. Skip 196, just straight 195. Are you serious? Me? I'm so excited. I don't even know what to do. I'm just so grateful. Then let me tell you about my crazy behind. Because I don't think y'all really understand that I'm literally seven pounds away from 188. 188 was the most weight I lost in 2020. I got to 188. 188, and then I just stopped. And just started back anyway but that's neither here nor there because we're not doing it this time but literally i am seven pounds away now i don't know if i'm gonna reach that seven pounds this month or next month which i'm believing next month i'll reach it the 180s because my goal baby is 165 y'all already know that and i'm sorry my phone is a little dirty i'm sorry but even though I, I hit that wonderful, wonderful milestone, 63 pounds down total. I am super duper excited about. I wanted a crumble cookie because they had a peanut butter cookie. And peanut butter cookies are like my, some of my favorite cookies. I love oatmeal cookies and I love peanut butter cookies. So I say, you know what, Tad? It's not going nowhere. It'll be back. You don't have to have it today. Because number one, somebody about to call me. Getting back to what I was saying. So I, I told myself, you know, and I literally thought I was gonna go get it, but I just really didn't want to. And I know why, because you know, every every time every time of the month, a woman craves different things, y'all. We got all types of hormones and stuff that we deal with. Probably would have been about 800 calories. I got these caramel rice, little chippies, like crisp, rice crisp. So I have a couple of those and I got me two lobster tails, a baked potato and some Brussels sprouts. And I got me some yogurt and I'll probably eat the yogurt tomorrow um, for breakfast. No, I won't because I got to have that. Uh, you know what I have to have tomorrow for breakfast? I have to have that kale or I might just do the kale Monday morning. So I, I might, I probably will have the granola. I'll have the granola. I have to have kale a, a lot because it's good to raise your i think it's my iron that needs to be raised yes yeah, so kale helps raise iron so i'm going to be putting instead of putting the baby spinach i'll be putting in my smoothies every day for five straight days baby kale but um that's it that's it i'm happy i'm excited i got a couple things i'm gonna show y'all my dinner 
tonight i got some hopefully my mama saves me one strawberry to eat tomorrow because i won't buy no more i spent 50 dollars in there today and i just went in there to get some lobster tails that were on sale and i ended up spending 50 dollars like that was not the plan but y'all want me to try one of these rice things with y'all i'm so happy 190 who weigh 200 not me 200 who 200 no i weigh no 200 pounds no 195 not big little one <laughs> little 195 200 baby y'all got me messed up i don't weigh no 200 pounds 195 period i know i'm silly i love y'all so i made it home and these are my brussels sprouts y'all that i'm cutting and these are the lobster tail sorry it's kind of dark this is the one i just cut and opened i opened one i said let me show them so i just cut and open this one and this is what they look like so what you do is you take your like kitchen scissors and cut them here I had to wash my kitchen scissors because somebody be using them. So I washed them really good and then I cut them from here. All right. And that's the outcome. And that's the outcome. So have to cut the legs off. All right. So if you make these, cut the legs off. All right, you guys. So I put some garlic salt and some smoked paprika on them. And that is my melted butter and parsley. I'm about to pour some. Well, not really pour it. Just kind of like stir it around and I guess pour it pour it on here y'all really can't see it's so dark today sorry y'all the light is terrible it's so terrible I don't even want to use it I can't even see what I'm doing so this is what I did the last time I just drenched some butter and parsley on it and eat them with light mine it was so delicious like he just loved it so that's it y'all the lobster tails are about to cook all right you guys so i am celebrating my three pound weight loss <laughs> don't them things look good y'all look at my lobster tails brussels sprouts and my potato y'all see it on my plate hey, y'all this is what i'm about to eat it tastes so yummy i taste it everything it's really really good yep too when i tell you that that food was so good when I tell you that food was good, y'all, it was so delicious. Like, I cannot believe I made those lobster tails. I'm going to use a tiny bit less salt the next time. Because I don't, I don't want to taste salt in my food. Um, and I could taste a little bit of salt. Probably because of the butter. Probably didn't hardly need any salt because of the butter. But they were really good full i haven't been full in a very long time but big bertha is making us way down and i squeeze the rest of my lemon in big bertha and i'm gonna drink that for on the rest of the night I'm not eating nothing else today because i don't need it <laughs> i had that meal and i had some um what's it i had all oh, the rice cakes and I had a baked potato, a delicious baked potato. So I had two carbs today. So we're done. We're done in the carbs and the meat and the veggies. But you know what? Tonight, if I get hungry, I might make me a smoothie. That's what I said I'm going to do. Put some kale and some strawberries and blueberries and some water and drink that. So that's probably what I'll eat tonight if I get hungry. About a good seven or eight. <sighs> so I can get some more veggies now. But I'm feeling good. I need my feet done. They look a hot mess. I haven't had them done in so long. <sighs> I'm just sitting here. My oven's still on. It keeps beeping. I dipped my lobster in this little butter here. So good. Um, I'm sleepy now. I'm about to go to sleep. <clears throat> I guess that's it for this video. I don't know how long this video is. But if you enjoyed this video, I want you to leave me a lobster tail or a shrimp or a crab leg or whatever under the sea emoji you want to leave, okay? If you enjoyed this video, this was a week in my life, honey. This is what I be doing every day, all day. That's what I do. 
I don't do much, but this is what I do. My life is, I'm content with it, you know. I am content with it. And the parts that, you know, I want God to operate in or I am believing God to operate in because it's his will and not mine, I am keeping my eyes open for it. Okay? But I love y'all. I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. I'm just going to make videos as long as y'all want me to. I don't care if one person watch it or five people watch it. I'm going to make my videos because this is a really good document for me to. I like to see where I'm at, you know. This is me, February 24th, 2004. I mean, 2024. <laughs> 2004, that was funny. 2024. This is, this is what I look like in 2024 at 44 years old. Right here, 44, 2024, on February 24th. This is me, okay? <sighs> Hope y'all enjoyed it. I love you.